This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news, all right? So uh, I have to say 21 Savage is kind of feeling himself after this Drake album. Now, it is a good album, arguably one of the best albums to drop this year. But Drake tapped him to do this album. Drake, what the, what's, the, what's the album we really want? Drake and Lil Wayne. Drake and Kodak Black. We want those, right? People weren't expecting this. But maybe that's why Drake went that way. Now, is it is Twenty One Savage a bad rapper? No, he's a good rapper. He's cool. You know, like he's not the best. Uh, I think Drake and Kodak Black would have been a little bit more unorthodox and uh, interesting. I think that Drake and Lil Wayne um, would have been amazing. Okay, we know that. I mean, they would have challenged each other on each track. But. Uh, 21 Savage now thinks that he can beat anybody on the freshman cover he was on. Uh, Kodak Black was on there. Now, I don't know why Designer chimed in, but uh, he only has one or two songs, you know? Uh, 21 Savage has way more better songs than Designer, okay? So Designer was tripping. Kodak Black's got a lot of great songs, man, and he's authentic, unapologetically himself, doesn't conform to what people want. 21 Savage does that. He bends. He bends for people. I'm sorry. I did. It. I can see it. He's like, he is industry. When people say, I ain't industry. I'm a rapper. No, no, no. You're industry, bro. You're, you're, you'll are you sacrifice who you really are. And that's, there's nothing wrong with that. It's called playing the game, right? Uh, let's listen to it. Here. Cover beat. Class beat me. I mean, that, that freshman cover beat me in our first. Mm. Nobody. Anderson Pack. Uh, Anderson, Anderson Pack. Hey man. How are you talking like that? Man, you're 21. One platinum 20 times. You know what I mean? I'm just chilling right now. I ain't even dropping nine right now. I gotta quit rap for a minute. Stop playing. Nah, friend of bitch, friend of junk, little bitch, you know, bitch. You always be my round, dope. You know what I'm saying? How old, dope? You know what I'm saying? Shit. I, I admire your confidence, though. And shit. That's how you should feel, you know what I mean? But, but you know, I'm always put myself first over, in, in, over, over, over any nigga, any day, too. You know what I'm saying? Oh, boy. That's cap. <laughs> <laughs> you cap that all day, boy. You know you cap that, boy. That shit cap. Well, you know, Kodak Black, I think he has the best point there. And, he, you know, he says, hey, you should feel this way. You should feel like you're the man. But, like, don't let, you know, that Drake album get the best of you, bro. Like, you know, <laughs> uh, you get, you know. You're supposed to feel like you're the man, but calm down. And 21 Savage always goes a little bit too far. I'm going to be honest with you. Remember when he was feeling himself on Clubhouse all the time? <laughs> this is Jordan Tao with JT News. Let me know what you guys think. I love the album. Don't get me wrong. But is he the best rapper? Maybe that freshman list wasn't even, like, it wasn't super strong. Let's be honest, you know? Um, Lil Uzi Vert has probably more hits than 21 Savage has, possibly. Who would I listen to personally? 21 Savage. But I'm just, you know, making the point. 